On today's Technical Corner, I've asked Scott from CG Tech to come back in to talk about Vericut. Now, we all know how important uh, of using simulation software, module, which is your force, and the cost savings that you can actually look at there. But one thing that Scott's going to talk about now is, is in-process measurement and how Verica actually uses it. Now, some, something that's quite interesting to me is, is that in-process measurement is quite key for a lot of engineers, but how does Verica make the best of that? So I think this is a very specific subject, Mark, and I think what we're doing with Verica, as I've said in previous technical corners, is always looking to emulate the CNC machine. That's what Verica does. And we see more and more customers in the market adopt probing on their machine tools. Okay, so this for specific example, we've got a tombstone loaded up with a bunch of parts. And what we can see here is we've got a main program and we have a sub program. Okay, so as the probe goes around this part, if I just push play, um, this actual program will make decisions. It's a logic based program. It's a very much a, a handwritten program. So we missed that one, we've missed a pot. So you can see on pot four, there's no part. So therefore, subsequently, the machining behind that doesn't go and machine pot four or position four on the tombstone because the probe has missed it. It's playing. It's not found it. So therefore, the NC code makes a decision. The logic in the NC code makes a decision not to go and waste time and machine um, position four on the tombstone. So this is this is quite common in automated environments. Okay, so maybe um, this, this particular machine's got two pallets. New pallet comes in, the probe comes in, checks around the part, missed, or oh, it's not there, so therefore, let's not machine it. It's not so, waste time. So is that code error then that it's analysing? It, it's, it, yes, it's doing two things. It's checking your logic, because if you imagine this is a logic-based program, if you, you can, there's only one way to check that, or two ways to check it. One's on the machine and, and one in Vericut. Yeah. So yeah. if you spend, I mean, we've, we've adopted customers fairly recently that spent hours and hours and hours doing this longhand on a machine. We can take all that offline, the machine's product producing parts while they're checking their, their probing logic and, and again, protecting the probe, not going to smash up the probe with a mistake in, in, their, in their NC code. Any other benefits over and above the, 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 the time saving and the cost of a probe? Um, it's cost to prove out. And, and those, those two things, again, we come back to core Vericut, the probing module will give you that, those two things as well. And, and when you sort of demonstrate this to, to uh, potential new clients, uh, I suppose they're quite taken in with this because it's obviously in-process measurement is quite key for a lot of companies these days, isn't it? Yes, it is. Um, and making the most of the machine. One thing you'll notice here as well, this is getting a little bit in depth, but it's a technical corner, so let's, let's, let's do that. It's just going to have a look at this tombstone and we can see in position number one and position number two this this actual part here has been made concentric but this has obviously been positioned incorrectly ah, so right, how can yeah, we yeah. rectify people will be thinking how can we rectify these sorts of problems on the machine and we can do this sort of thing with probing and this project has a variable in so if I just close that and do a reset we're at start again now so let's just look at our project variables and it doesn't matter if you've got an automated process then? No, this is all about automation. Right, okay. So it's yeah. checking, yeah. checking yeah. the logic before it gets to the machine. So now we'll just type that variable in one. Now what we're going to do is just say, okay. Now the probe not only just checks the planes, it also checks the bores. So therefore, if you can see that they're running now, it's checking the bores as well as the planes. So therefore, the actual work offset on the machine will update um, according to what it's probed. So therefore, it will be machined concentric and correct. Okay, well, and these are, the, these are the sorts of things that people do on machines that take an awful lot of time to check through. Yeah. And this is the benefit being, the benefit to the customer is we're protecting the probe, and we're checking it all through before you take it to the machine. Well, it's quite incredible, isn't it? Because in process measurements, a big thing, automation, which obviously, yet again, it's it's just proving that job out and obviously saving you uh, probe, uh, smashing a probe up, which uh, does happen. And it's very costly. So, um, 
Thanks very much for your time on this. Vericut is a very powerful tool and it's, it's great to actually see a different variation within Vericut. So any engineers actually watching this video that want to learn a little bit more, call Scott, it come down and give you a fantastic demo.